The tour to Georgia has come and gone here, but another ride is heading for Savannah, helping to beat multiple sclerosis. The 2008 Bike MS Georgia Power Savannah Ride kicks off May 3rd, and I was humbled to be asked to serve as the honorary chair. It's been wonderful so far. We're still a good deal away from the ride. Now comes the hard part, however, the training. Our medical reporter, reporter Melanie Roberti, and I met one woman who stepped up to help me out. And Melanie, I got to tell you, Dr. Jay Lander is, she's knowledgeable when it comes to riding, but that ain't all. Yeah, she definitely puts you in your place, that's for sure. I, just, I like Dr. Lander. <laughs> well, she was diagnosed with relapsing and remitting multiple sclerosis back in the 1970s. Mm -hmm. But as Sonny and I both found out very quickly, she doesn't let the disease get her down. In fact, she uses it to train and ride in as many MS bike rides as she can, raising money to find a cure. Yahoo! <laughs> Dr. Jay Lander isn't letting multiple sclerosis or Sonny Dixon slow her down. For her, writing is a form of therapy. Jay is a professor in physical therapy at Armstrong Atlantic State University. She knows the benefits of exercise will help keep her MS at bay. And the more severe you are, uh, the more necessary it is to get that exercise because otherwise just sitting around makes you worse. You lose that strength, you lose that endurance. Gracia. With plenty of energy to spare, Jay slowed down long enough to give our own Sonny Dixon some tips. An avid cyclist, he hasn't been able to train the way he'd like. With less than two weeks to go until the ride, he needs to build up stamina. Ride several miles, uh, do what you can the first day, and then increase it each day. Keep uh, practicing and riding and, and making sure that you know your turns well. For Jay, using a recumbent bike is easier for her to retain her balance and endurance. She never travels anywhere without her water bottles or cooler, both essential for race day. Lots of fruits and vegetables, of course, and hydration, hydration, hydration. Always drink some water. Hydrate yourself tremendously before the bike ride. After pedaling the streets of Savannah, Jay proclaims Sunny fit for the ride. He's working into it. He needs a little bit more practice um, to make the whole mileage, but he'll do fine. Remember to stay hydrated. <laughs> <laughs> but he did pretty good. Jay hopes the ride will be a fun experience that will also raise money for MS research and hopefully find a cure. An outcome both Sonny and Jay continue to ride for. Whether it be building up to that mileage that you want to make or the speed you want to ride or the cure you want to find for a disease. Success doesn't come in a day. It takes time. It takes the commitment a lot of, of a lot of people and uh, it's worth it. <laughs> now the 2008 Bike MS Georgia Power Savannah Ride will be on May 3rd and 4th. Now you can join Sunny and others to either ride or just pledge money. Now for that information just log on to our website. It has all the details and you can also get more information on the signs and symptoms of multiple sclerosis. Now she put you through a workout. She did. She really did. <laughs> I, was, I, I was worn out afterwards and I just love her. She, she wanted us to mention too. She's very grateful mm -hmm. to some sponsors who help her along the way not just this year but previous years. Savannah Toyota and Tidal Construction along with the faculty and staff at Armstrong Atlantic State That's right. University. Did she a good job. actually had her own team of walkers called the Jay Walkers. They're, I love that, yeah. Dr. Jay Lander. And, of course, sponsoring my little team leading the Bike MS ride this year is Granger Honda. I want to thank Mark Granger for that. And a team from Thomas and Hutton Engineering is headed for Hunter Army Airfield. I'm going to go try to catch up with them. We're going to train <laughs> some more tonight. Dr. Jay, I'm doing what you told me. He is, and he will be up to date and ready to roll on May 3rd. Y'all have to come on out and see him do it. Love it. Thank you. It was fun. It was. Mm-hmm.